Welcome back to the SMT YouTube channel. In this video, we discuss the updates we're seeing from the publications on what you actually can do with T Satellite, T Mobile's Starlink's uh, partnership in offering satellite connectivity to your smartphone. All right, so the article, I'll be sure to link it for you guys from Michael Can. Uh, he's published it. This is, you know, kind of like, I guess, an update on what you can do with your phone when you're connected to T Satellite. So, according to him, and his results. He said he was connected to T-Mobile's T-Satellite service through Starlink. Uh, and I think he said he was testing it with some Samsung phones and also some Motorola phones. And in his testing and usage, he was able to send regular text, right? So SMS. He was able to send messages, audio clips, and video. That's what he claims, okay? So don't come back at me saying, ah, oh, that doesn't work. And... This, I wasn't able to do it and blah, blah, blah. I, I'm just talking about the article that he posted, that he published, sharing his experiences. So he, it looks like, specifically went to an area where he knew T-Mobile didn't have the native coverage. It went into the whole, like, you know, satellite mode or whatever, sent him a text message to verify that he was indeed, you know, on the T-Satellite service. And then he started trying to do stuff uh he said that he was uh doing this at the big tajunga dam i i don't even know never heard of that uh, so <laughs> i'll have to look at a map uh but he sent uh multimedia messaging through the default app on a samsung galaxy s24 fe that did have the t satellite included in the plan uh he said that at&t did not have signal Right, so this this may be one of those like national park kind of areas where they're not allowed to have cell service, or I should say they're not allowed to build cell towers, right? Which means the only way you're going to get a signal within this type of area is going to be through satellite, right? So you see where the T satellite piece comes into play here. Uh, he said he was also able to receive images and audio while he was sitting in his car on a remote hill. Um, he said his AT&T phone still had service, so he was able to utilize that normally. Uh, but he was just kind of showing that for comparison. Uh, I think he said the clips, the video clips, were like five seconds long. Uh, but it took <laughs> over ten minutes for the first clip to go through, and then twenty minutes for the second one. Um, wow. Okay, and of course, that's probably going to lead to battery drain trying to send and receive for that long. Um... Look, guys, I don't know. I don't know about you, but if I'm trying to send a five second video clip and it's taking 10 or 20 minutes, you're better off saving your battery, right, from draining because you know it's going to be pulling hard trying to get a signal. You're better off just waiting to send a video at that point, right? I mean, 10, 20 minutes, you're better off just driving away trying to find a cellular signal and i would venture a guess that if you're going 60 70 miles per hour on an interstate you're probably going to find a cell signal within 10 minutes you know and then then you'll be able to to send or receive your and make your calls and do whatever else i don't uh god man um so anyways uh i i do know that t-mobile has said to kind of not expect you know the the data piece until later in the year and this might be kind of the early moments of this uh, but that's not ideal uh, it's good that the messaging is working as promised I don't know if anybody's have had made any calls on this service yet he didn't mention anything about calling but I mean I guess it's a step in the right direction right the 10 to 20 minutes is rough but I mean it's something uh, so I guess if you're a T-Mobile customer and you're willing to pay the 10 bucks or move up to the plans that included that are more expensive let me know if you're interested now that they've have some proof of concept, I suppose. Let me know. Drop me some comments. Like, share, subscribe. Check out some more videos. We'll see you guys soon on the next one.